In the last episode, Caleb and Lurk decided to go to the town to find some odd jobs. They found an old lady in their path, so Lurk decided it would be best to punch her in the face and steal her money. Now they are 65 gold richer, and their adventure continues. Okay, well, we're here. Let's see if we can buy you a weapon. Ah, and I see we've got new customers today. Will, what can I interest you in? Yeah, we were wondering if you had any really, really cheap weapons on sale today. Ah, actually, as a matter of fact, I do. Take a look at this axe. That giant ruby pommel. The big cardboard looking blade. It's almost orgasmic. Oh my god, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's... <laughs> It's just great! <laughs> we gotta get it now! Okay, okay, calm down. Uh, excuse me, sir, but how much is this axe? You can get it for the low, low price of 150 gold. Um, uh, are you sure you can't go cheaper than that? Because, I mean,. <laughs> You know, it'd be really nice if you did. Come on, you know you want to. You can give us a discount, come on. God damn it, fine. Don't give us a discount. <sighs> come on, Lurk. We can't get your axe. No! Falcon Punch! Oh my god, I want fire! Oh my god, Lurk, did you just do it again? Oh, I want the axe, dammit! Oh, grab it, let's get the hell out of here! Grab noise! Yay, now we can celebrate! No we can't, you dumb bastard! Look, his body's setting the whole damn place on fire! <laughs> run, goddammit, run! And so our heroes set off into another adventure. With a new axe in Lurk's hand, he runs with pride and stupidity. If you want to know more, find out next time on the fourth episode of The Adventures of Caleth and Lurk.